All right, everybody, thank you for joining me for the Truman Show reaction. All right, first time watching this film, Jim Carrey's in it. We've become bored with watching actors give us phony emotions. While the world he inhabits is, in some respects, counterfeit, there's nothing fake about Truman himself. Sounds like a reality show. You're going to have to go on without me. We find many viewers leave him on all night for comfort. My, my life is my life, is the Truman Show. A truly blessed life. Yeah, tell me something I don't know. Wait, are they live streaming his entire right, life? Promise me one thing, though. It's all real. Nothing here is fake. On this show. So they're a part of a show centered around Truman, which I'm assuming is Jim Carrey here. Oh, wow. Okay. Good morning. Morning. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Oh, get down. He won't hurt oh. you. Get down. Yeah, I know. Dogs are always like that. You never know if they're going to be friendly or not when they jump on you like that. <laughs> Look at them. Rhea. Oh, my God. What? Frig is that? Just falls from the sky. Does he know a life outside of here? I have so many questions. There's an aircraft in trouble began shedding parts. Does he think it was flying somewhere? Nope. Oh, good. It's like the radio was talking to him as well. Okay. I'm trying to get the vibe that this is like an enclosed community and it's all centered around Truman being live streamed, but everybody else is here just living their own lives. One of these, the wife. The wife, does he have a wife or was he just picking up a magazine for bathroom material? We'll find out. Nice talking to you, you too. You too. Wait, wait, they pushed him in front of that advertisement on purpose. So that maybe that's their business they're trying to advertise it? Okay, I'm starting to connect all the dots here of what's going on. I think, at least. I'm not that anxious to get there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's his job done? <laughs> He's making a secret phone uh, call. Can I have directory assistance? Oh, I'm sorry, ma'am. If, if uh, he's in a coma, he's probably uninsurable. He works in insurance. Yes. Uh, Fiji, please. Do you have a Sylvia Garland? <laughs> he really doesn't want to do his job. It's just large glamour shots over and over again. <laughs> Maybe that's Got her. Got a prospect in Wells Park I need you to close. Why well, I can't. I uh, have an appointment. Dentist. Yeah, he didn't want to go. Man, he doesn't want to do anything with his job. He obviously doesn't like his job. He hates it. I missed it. One way or return? Return. This is crazy. It's like the whole world revolves around him. The fairy was held so that he could make it on time. It's like everybody's playing along and not letting him know that he's part of a TV show. Because they did say at the beginning, people watch him and they fall asleep. And they emphasized how, like, no, this is fake. Everybody's just living their own lives. Whoa, why does that shock him so much? Do you need any help, sir? You go ahead, I'll, I'll be fine. He's afraid of boats now. Come on, you gotta go. Your job's calling. Hi, honey. <laughs> nice butt Look shot. Look what I got free at the checkout. Never need sharpening dishwasher sale. Wow. Like an advertisement. That's amazing. Perfect looking neighborhood in a secluded little area. Somebody who's afraid to travel so they're not going out to try to view the whole world. Where's there to go? Fiji. <laughs> <laughs> Where the hell is Fiji? Okay. This is us. All the way around here. Peachy, can you get any further away before you start coming back? <laughs> That's a good quote. I like it. So, when are you gonna go? Money, planning, up and go. Why not? Can't live in the Do moment. Do it. So is there any way for him to leave this? What is he, like, on an island or something? Crazy. I have so many questions. I'm sure it'll all get answered in time, but... Well, look at that weather, son. I think we should head back. No, come on, we should go back. Wait now. Oh, he's having a horrible flashback. That's why he's afraid of boats. Here we go. That's extra traumatic because he's the one that said, let's keep going. Let's not turn back. So he'll blame himself for it. Real quick, everybody, I'd like to take a moment to tell you about this video sponsor, BetterHelp. Many people, including myself, use movies and TV as a way to escape the challenges of the real world. Take me, for example, the stresses of a heavy workload with deadlines, long hours of editing, while also trying to juggle my responsibilities as a husband and a father. It can wear anyone down to a breaking point. So I'd like to ask, is there anything interfering with your happiness or preventing you from achieving your goals? Such as depression or anxiety. As life keeps throwing challenges their way, people handle these type of issues in different ways. However, therapy can provide you with the tools to approach life in a way that keeps you in control and productive. And that's why I'm excited to tell you about today's sponsor, BetterHelp. BetterHelp's goal is to make therapy more affordable and accessible to those who need it. Finding a therapist can be a challenge and a bit overwhelming, but BetterHelp makes it easy. 
Since their platform is online and remote, all it takes is answering a few questions and BetterHelp can match you with a professional therapist in as little as a few days. There's a link down in my description. Just go to betterhelp.com slash newfie. Clicking that link not only supports this channel, but it also gets you 10% off your first month with BetterHelp, allowing you to connect with a therapist and see if it helps you. And if for some reason you're not connecting with a specific therapist, you can easily switch to a new one at no additional cost. So if you're like most people out there struggling with the hardships of life, please consider online therapy with BetterHelp. If so, click the link in the description or visit betterhelp.com slash newfie and thank you BetterHelp for supporting this show. Oh. He's going through a lot. Oh, really? Just laying directly on him? Oh, so it broke. Look at that. Whatever. So are they must be in a dome then. If somebody can control the rain, which looks like it's in the night sky. You're talking like a teenager. Come on now. Maybe let I feel live. like a teenager. We have car payments. What, we're just going to walk away from our financial obligations? It's an adventure. Get away. See some of the world. Explore. Everybody's trying to talk him out of it. Let's get you out of these wet clothes. Hmm? Oh, hello. Come to bed. <laughs> you never see anything anyway. They always, you know, the, the wind blows in and the curtains move and you don't see anything. So that's people on the outside in the real world watching him and they're, they're complaining because it fades to black every time Truman tries to have relations with his wife. This is an interesting concept for a movie. I'm still trying to wrap my head around it, but I like it. Why does he like these magazines where he rips out pictures of the girl's eyes? Who are, this is all the TV crew coming in? His dad didn't actually drown. It was all a part of the show? He's going to catch on, right? With that weird rain cloud just over only him. And now that he's seen his father and then all this weird TV crew rushes out and scoots him off. It doesn't sound insane at all, true. I almost hugged a perfect stranger in the salon last Thursday. It was Dad. It's about time they cleaned up the trash downtown before we become just oh, like the rest of the country. Oh, calling people trash. They never Not found cool. Dad's body. Maybe Don't believe him. Did Dad have a brother? Only child, just like you. Everybody trying you to downplay it. You sailing off into that storm, but I've never blamed you, Truman. Truman's got a lot going on up there. A lot of like issues to deal with. That's for sure, living in a world like this with a traumatic past. He got a locked up chest with all of his memories, eh? There you go, I want to look at his father's face. Truman, <laughs> what are you doing down here? He quickly, arbitrarily starts working. I saw my father today. I know, your mother called. You really ought to throw out that mower. Get one of those new elk rotaries. Come on, they throw in an advertisement whenever they can. Ridiculous, and he doesn't catch on to all the fake ad placements. His basement's pretty cool. He's got all kinds of memories here. It's like his own little happy place. Father's clothes. See, they got rid of her, but they couldn't erase the memory. Or oh, her. Who is this now? Who is he in love with? Is that the girl he was calling about earlier? Oh, the eye contact. Oh, wow, okay. That's a bit of an interest there. Oh, look at this. Suddenly a cheerleader throws themselves in his arms. Oh, that's his wife. And she's gone. Was that his love at first sight? Woo! Work it, work it, work it, work it, work it. What kind of dance is that? Looking at your shoulders. I love it, though. Oh, he's looking everywhere for her. Oh, there she is. Look at this. No matter how much you're trying to force this cheerleader on him, he's still got eyes for her. Oh, no, and they take her away again. And as always, if you want to watch along for the entire length of the Truman Show reaction with me, that'll be available on my Patreon page or as a YouTube member. If you click join down below, you will need your own copy of the Truman Show to sync up with the timestamp, but otherwise, it'll be friggin' sweet. Later, loser. Oh, she really forced herself Ouch. into that relationship, Shh. hey. Looks like he don't know what to do with himself. Looking to see if it's who he hopes it is. She got close to him again. Konnichiwa. <laughs> Konnichiwa. Take Japanese. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, she don't know Japanese at all. Don't even know hello in Japanese. Come on now. I'm allowed to talk to you. 
Look, that's the exact sweater right. that he had there too. Right. No, it's not. Of course, not in the basement. Is it? Was it Meryl, the girl? I like your pen. Would you want to maybe possibly go out for some pizza or something? If we don't go now, it won't happen. Oh, jeez. Do you understand? The eyes. There's the eyes. That's why he's so fascinated with the eyes. And is that that magazines? Is she like a model or that appeared? Trying to think back now to what model was in that magazine, but yeah, he's probably just saving her eyes because of that moment right there. I like it. A time when he's living in the moment, right? Like he said, he struggled to just drop everything and just go on an adventure, and here it is. This is probably like the greatest moment of his entire life. Just being Please free. Keep your hands inside the car! <laughs> Look at her looking over her shoulder. She was just because she knows any moment now they're going to come get her. So little time. They're going to be here any minute. Who are? They don't want me talking to you. Don't talk. Oh my God. How can he go on living after having a moment like this? Listen to me. Oh. Everybody knows you. Everybody knows everything you do. Do you understand? Everybody's pretending. Oh, my name's Sylvia. Sylvia. Yeah. Sylvia. Far, sweetheart. I'm her father. What? I've no. never even seen you before. Doing it. Please, everything I've on? told you is the truth. Please. This is set. I don't it's a show. She's spinning around. Please, don't listen please, to him. Please, Get what? We tried everything. Episodes. All they're blaming it on some kind of... You're not come the on first. now. You're not the first. He's true and he's lying. Get out of here. Come on, find Don't me. worry. We're moving to Fiji. That's why he got the obsession with Fiji. Look at this. She spilled everything. So that put the seed of doubt in his head. That I'm sure he's Sylvia! had ever since then. Hey! Why didn't you just follow her to Fiji? His mother got sick, really sick. I can't believe he married Merle on the rebound. This is crazy. There's an outside world just watching his life for entertainment, all of his struggles. and I can see it being fascinating, though. Like, how's it going to end? That is the question. And he ended up being with Merle, even though he didn't want to. He tries to piece together. That's what he's doing. So it wasn't actually... He's just trying to find eyes that are closest to hers. He's got that good of a memory, hey? That he can remember exactly what her eyes are like. Look at her now on the outside, watching him trying to recreate her because he's so in love with her. Oh, okay, well, that's a glitch in her programming. Okay, he's making his turn on the Lancaster Square. No, he tapped into their broadcast. Oh my God. Oh, jeez. Look at that. Everybody's got an earpiece in. Ouch. Good driver's a safe driver. Safe driver is what? Yes. Right? What's the chance that somebody start talking about safe driving just as he almost gets in an accident? Man, whoever's running this production has gone all out, that's for sure. But, uh, I mean, it would be the probably the greatest television show in history. But it's also cruel, the fact that making this guy live out his life and in a fake reality... They were saying it's not fake, but clearly now you can see that it is. The whole world revolves around him. It's not like reality at all. He's starting to see. The veil is coming down. Pretending to be tying a shoe. Oh, I got a feeling now he's going to start testing the waters, right? Pity he couldn't stay tuned into that station, but they cut the feed, I think, right? I was going to say, is he actually just going mad in his head? Like, is this all just from his point of view? I wonder, is that how it's going to end? Or is it actually... But why would they keep doing the cutaways hey, to people's reaction of the show? What is he doing? No, no, no. What's security going to do now? What's this building for? Look at this. Behind the scenes. He's seen the camera crew. Remodeling. Come on. Inside of an elevator. You get the break room. <laughs> I like it. So now he's got to deal with all the mental issues of realizing that his whole reality, everything that he's ever known has been fake. Can you imagine how much that would just break a person? A lot of strange things have been happening. People on the elevator, there was no, there was no backing on it. I think this is about my dad. Your dad? I think he's alive. That's what I'm unpredictable. That's the thing they can't, you know. Look at that, everybody's playing along. He's gonna be pushing the limits so much. <laughs> okay, man, let's do it. What? Birthday what? comes but once a year. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna bring the whole thing down now somehow. Like your whole life has been building towards something? No. What was the furthest you ever got off the island? Went all over. Never found a place like this though. 
Look at this, reinforcing how great it is here. Happiest day of our lives. You just cut yeah. onto the Photoshop. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. Your favorite show will be coming on. Come yeah. on now. It sucks. Show Sharp. me the way to go home. A hymn of praise to small town life. Look at this. They're doing everything they can to convince them. Come on, keep looking. You'll find a flaw. See, see, little by little, he's gonna catch on. I need to talk to you. <laughs> I'd love to, but I'm really late. What's your rush? Surgery. There was that, that elevator disaster downtown. It was on the news last night. Look at him cover and damage control over and over again. I'll cross my fingers for you. Cross my fingers for you. Oh, today's the day that he's gonna figure out what's going on. He already got it figured out, but he's gonna really take it to the next level, I think. Excuse okay. me, may, um, may I help? My wife, Nurse Burbank. It's very important. You know She's I'm in pre-op. Pass along a message. I I'll like try. the fish eye lens. Can you tell her I had to go to Fiji? I'll tell her. Thank you so much. Yeah, okay, here we go. <laughs> Look at this. And he's following her. I love it. They're all trying to come and cut him off. Sorry. Yeah, come Here, on. Now, back. come on. Oh, they went all out, though. They got the I'm surgery sure. on the go and everything. And I'm now making cooking. my primary incision. He's doing it as slow <laughs> as possible. Oh, shh. She's not even put under. <laughs> so fake. He's going to be nothing but trouble now. They're not going to be able to reel him back in. The whole show is going to fall apart. I love it. It could happen to you, look. Try and discourage him from travel. I would like to book a flight to Fiji. No, let me guess, they're booked up solid, right? I'm sorry, I don't have anything for at least a month. A month? Make other arrangements. <laughs> He's just gonna end up getting in the car and going. All aboard! Thank you. No, that was too late. They delayed it exactly Pretty enough. City, they... here we come. Oh no, Hi. I thought they were gonna make him be late. <laughs> the bus driver don't even know how to drive a bus. Really? You couldn't even get an actor who knows how to drive a bus to play the bus? <laughs> Come on. Everybody off. We've got a problem. Sorry, son. What? You're sorry that you're a bus driver and don't know how to drive a bus? Look, he ain't going anywhere. He knows now. This is it. Every time he tries to take a step, they push him back. Now, everybody keep trying to keep up this masquerade. Honey, are you okay? But in just a moment see a lady on a red bike followed by a man with flowers and a Volkswagen Beetle are they repetitive the now how's she gonna explain lady. this lady flowers no there care. it is there it is there's there the dented beetle <laughs> 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 yeah yeah this is gonna drive him to madness they just go around and around Our call. are you listening to a word I'm no. saying no nope. you're upset because you want to go to Fiji is that it I think you should save the for a few months let and then go let's go now they're pushing him to a breaking point here. Driving Where shall we go? Where shall we go? Guess I'm being spontaneous. <laughs> <laughs> He's just randomly driving so they won't be able to stop him. Oh, here we go. So look at this traffic. They're doing whatever they can to stop him. Every turn. It's going to drive him more and more mad. He's going to end up breaking down. Let's go home. <laughs> Look at him. I changed my mind. Uh, uh, <laughs> New Orleans like this time of year. He's really <laughs> driving up. He's going to drive the crew mad. Like the people trying to control this situation. This is a nightmare. Here we go. The bridge. You Whoa. know you can't drive over water. Safe. That's his fear of water. Oh. Drive. <laughs> Making her drive. Making her do it, or else she dies. <laughs> yep, he's going mad. Forest fire, extreme danger. Oh yeah. Nope. They're going all out. He's going psycho. I love it. Oh my, what's the raid sirens for now? What now? Yeah, exactly. How many obstacles? Radiation leak or something, is it? Looks like a leak at the plant. Thank you for your help. You're welcome, Truman. Truman. He knows his name. Why would this guy on the outskirts of town in a place that he's never been know his name? Truman! Truman! Yeah, come on. Go, Truman. Go. Come on. If somebody's crazy enough that they're going to run in there. Cameras in all the elms. Oh. 
It's making for good entertainment at this point. Probably their highest ratings yet. He's like a rat in a cage. Let me get you some help, Truman. You're not well. You can't stand me. It's true. It is true. Look at her head to turn away. Why don't you let me fix you some of this new Mo Coco drink? Who are you talking to? What's happening? Jeez, oh, well, I don't know. He's going to turn You're having violent. a nervous breakdown. That's what's happening. Yep. Nope. You are scaring me. Choice. No. Oh, no. Do something. Oh, look at that. Do something. She just broke character. Who are you talking to? Nothing. I didn't say anything. Oh. Oh, please, please stop. Stay He's going to turn him into a psycho. He shows up exactly now. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. oh here we go. It's unprofessional. Unprofessional. There we go. She's spilling it all. Maybe I'm losing my mind. I'm wondering if he is losing his mind and this is actually, it's all in his head or not, you know? Like, that would be the crazy ending. I've been your best friend since we were seven years old, Truman. You're the closest thing I ever had to a brother, Truman. Here we go. He's trying to reel him back in by relating to him. And the last thing I'd ever do is lie to you. He's feeding him lines. And the last thing that I would ever do... Why can he say it? lie to you. If everybody is in on it, I'd have to be in on it, too. That's got to be tough from his point of view, though. He's known him since he was seven. I found him for you, Truman. Uh-oh, what's going on here now? Did they convince him to be a part of it? Maybe oh, yeah. they paid him millions of dollars to play along? Making it as dramatic as possible? This is so cruel what they're doing to Truman. People can't even do their jobs. They're so captivated. Son. Oh. Don't try no, 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 no. Fade up music. Holy crap. Make Years wasted. Look at him, he's like a friggin' composer and director and trying to create his masterpiece. I wouldn't be able to. If I knew this man, it'd be like, this is way too cruel to be doing to somebody on a daily basis. Twist somebody's life like that and make them in a fake world and no. I admit it would be crazy entertaining and what a social experiment, but you know, still, to mess up somebody's life like that, it's just not worth it. How can she get through to him again? Really, even from the birth. Oh. Here we go. It's a dome. I knew it had to be a dome because there's no other way to have the night sky and then rain in one spot. The lunar room. The Look world's at this. greatest television. The world within a world that is Sea Haven Island. I think it's worth noting that this is not the first time that someone from the outside has attempted to right. reach. Drew it! It's television! Yes! <laughs> Truman grew up. We were forced to manufacture ways to keep him on the island. I like to be an explorer. There's really nothing left to explore. What a thing to say, crushing his dreams. Truman's been terrified of the water ever since. When Kirk was disappointed, to say the least. Is that his real father then? Or was it just an actor? The one who was elected. In competition with five other unwanted pregnancies. What? So it's that's not his real father then? That answers it. He was just an unwanted baby. Uh, all those staggering revenues are generated by product placement. Exactly. That's true. Discovering the true nature of his world until now. We accept the reality of the world with which we're presented. You're a liar and a manipulator, and what you've done Ooh. to Truman is sick. Well, we remember this voice, don't we? Oh, here we go. It's her. You think because you batted your eyes at Truman once? Thrust yourself and your politics into the limelight that you know what's right for him. What right do you have to take a baby and, and, and turn his life into some kind of mockery? I have given Truman the chance to lead a normal life. And that is not nothing normal about what he's doing. Come on. He was absolutely determined to discover the truth. There's no way we could prevent him. Truman prefers his cell. You're so wrong. And he'll prove you wrong. I think it's super cruel what he's doing. No. I'm determined the television's first on-air conception will still take place. Oh, well, wow. So then they can control that baby, I guess, right? And keep the show going. Sick. So this guy's life, the director, he's had to spend the last 20, 30 years as well now. Just every day waking up, watching his life. So, like, he's obsessed about it now. He's fanatical about the show, the success of the show. And, like, he feels like he's playing God. Like, he's literally controlling Truman's life. Everything that happens. He'll never give up that kind of power. Look at him. Yeah, he's got a weird fascination with him for sure. Yep, there you go. What does he view him like the son he never had or what? <laughs> Proclaim this planet. Trumania. 
<laughs> of the Burbank Galaxy. He's got a different outlook now. Morning! Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. <laughs> Trying oh, to get hey, back Pluto, to his whoop, old whoop, self. Whoop, whoop. Good, good morning, Toronto. Oh, the same thing. Really? They did the same thing every day? Oh, trying to bring in a new oh, love interest. Excuse me. Uh, Truman, this is Vivian. They put neighbors. a red sweater on her as well. Oh, life is fragile. Don't fall for it, Truman. Don't fall for it. Come on now. I love that he has his own gardening clothes. I should get a set of clothes that I only wear when I mow the lawn and go out of the garden so the neighbors can see me with my gardening clothes on. <laughs> What's he doing in the basement? He moved down there after Meryl packed up and left. He's just sleeping, I thought. This is the best shot we've got? Uh, he's not there, is he? I'm wondering if he's not actually under those blankets and he snuck away. That'd be cool if he could get himself off frame, off camera. But I'm sure somebody would report it in the moment he's running through the street or whatever. Isolate the audio. Give me a close-up on his torso. Where's Chloe? Yes, sir. Call him. What do you Tell mean? him it's a wrong number. He came down into the room. He did nothing but stand around for a while. Shut up and watch. Okay, here we go. He must have slipped away, action. right? There. Stop it. Right. Zoom in. Is it? Oh, my God. What? He couldn't I... have gone up the stairs. I def... he, he must still be Get in the room. Ooh, he escaped. He's on the loose. I love it. Yep. I was thinking, I guess it's the traditional, you know, go into bed, pull the sheets up over, and he's not really there. Surprise party. Oh. I got a six-pack of cold brewskis with our name on them. It ain't him at all. Look at this. <laughs> oh, snap. He made a tunnel. He's gone. Cut transmission. Cut transmission? Cut it. For the first time ever. Oh. Oh, the whole operation's going bad. I love it. Yeah, okay. Oh, wow, the moon can become a spotlight now. This is going to ruin it all. Their whole operation is over. Yeah, I wonder where he's snuck off to, where he's hiding. Citywide search, the moment you sneak out of your house is like, yeah, there's no going back now. Cue the sun. The sun? Good job. What's going on? What's the first positions, right? First positions, look. What? Like they're in, they're just waiting for their moment to be told to act. We're not watching the sea. The sea? There's somewhere. Come on, he's got to be in a no. boat somewhere. He got a boat. Oh, we got a okay, sailboat. Sail. He's an insurance. I was expecting a rowboat. At this point, he's not afraid of anything. Look at him on a sailboat. Yeah. There. Got a camera on even the boat. Come on, I hope he gets his freedom. Come on, come on. I want to see him get out and get in the real world. Oh, look, and he's doing it all for Sylvia, just trying to get there. Go, Truman, go. Getting goosebumps. Let's get another boat on. Get it moving. Get it out of here. They don't know how. <laughs> yeah, you didn't even know how to drive a bus. They're actors. There you go. Uh-oh. We're going to be accessing the weather program. I think we're going to want to localize the storm over the boat. There's no rescue boat. He's going to crank it up, hope to make a storm to get him to turn back. There's no rescue boat available. He's going to fall overboard and drown just like his father did. Man, if he goes as far as killing Truman for in the name of entertainment, well then that's it. He's done. Oh. Again. Ooh. Get him again. Oh, jeez, overdoing it much? The whole world is watching. We can't let him die in front of a live audience. He was born in front of a live audience. Oh, yeah. See, he's playing God, all right. Does he still have a hold of the rope? Looks like he does. Yeah. Dude got a God complex. He's going to see this through to the end. You can do it! <laughs> that guy's invested in. Go, Truman. Go. Just keep going. Is that the best you can do? There we go. You're going to have to kill me! Woo! They broke Increase him. the wind! Capsize him. Tip him over. Damn you, Trick no, You can't. His time is up to the button. Shut up! Not doing it. No, don't do it. Make him press the button. Make him be the one to kill him, right? Oh my god, really? Can't blame him. Can't be pushed that far, manipulated that much. Really killing him off on live TV now. But they got a nice shot of him drowning. Hope it was That's worth tough. it. He wanted to kill him at sea. He wanted to push it. He wanted him to be born in front of the world and die in front of the world. He wanted his ending. He's alive. He's moving. 
can you not help but feel for this guy? Come on. Look at this. He's not giving up. Relentless. He'll sail till it kills him. Give him his freedom. He's earned it. He weathered the storm. He weathered everything that they could throw at him. I thought it would be tougher than that. Bust through it, man. Now he sees that it was all fake. His whole life fake. They don't let him out. How would you ever go on living? You wouldn't be able to. Oh, it's shallow, man. Look at him. His mind is blown. What a scene. What a visual here. A set of stairs with a door. I love it. You want to talk to him. What could you possibly say to justify your actions? He wanted to be an explorer, they said at the beginning. I can hear you. Who are you? I am the creator. Of no. Then who am I? You're the star. Was nothing real? Nothing you was real. You were real. There's no more truth out there than there is in the world I created for you. But in my world, you have nothing to fear. No. Come on, you want to be an explorer, you want to step into the unknown, do it. You can't leave, Truman. You belong here. No. Frig no. Talk to me. I'll be incredibly disappointed if he stays. You lied to the whole world! In case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Wow. <laughs> How yeah. he started every day. Give him a give him bow. Give him the bow. Yes. Yes. Oh yeah. Look at this. We made, made it. You can't play God anymore, buddy. Your whole world's gone now. What else is on? Yeah, let's do what else. TV guy. Holy crap! It ended like that, man. I want to see how Truman perceived the outside world. How we end up meeting up with Sylvia and doing all these kind of things. Either way, but it still is a cool ending because it leaves it all to our imagination. I loved it. Either way, before you take off any work, comment down below. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Watch one of these things. I'll see you in the next one. Peace and love, everybody. I'll see you later. All right? Take care. Bye-bye.